Hi, welcome again. Today I want to make an announcement. As of today, I'm not a uh, continued development of the Open Land Mesh plugin for Unreal Engine. And thank you for supporting me. And if you purchase this plugin on the marketplace, you can simply get a 100% refund. And there's a link in the description and it will look something like this. You can uh, select as a customer and simply ask for a refund and give this information and simply say that this plugin is not in the active development and the author is ask you to get a refund and they will simply approve that. I started as OpenLand Mesh as the geometry node implementation in Unreal Engine. You can make uh, geometry changes even in the runtime. It's, it's uh, accelerated by GPU and so on. But there's no much interest in the community for such product. The reason is uh, quite understandable because we have Houdini uh, as a really large product and also we have Blender uh, with a lot of uh, geometry nodes kind of thing and there's no much interest in uh, doing that inside Unreal Engine and that's understandable. So what people need are uh, a better terrain product. So basically they need the uh, procedural terrain generator and so on. So yeah, then I started uh, trying to implement that one. Then we made it to some 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 extent, and I made some interesting things. There are some very uh, really really great product on the community as well. So let, let me share some of those things. And this is one of the interesting one called Shadeable. It's quite affordable. I think it's around something eighty dollars, and it was free uh, back then when you when they started. So now it's uh, around eighty dollars, but it's it's totally fine and it's a really good uh, deal. Um, so it's uh, it's really nice. It does everything uh, GPU uh, based. Uh, it has foliage and uh, ocean system and it's really really nice. So if you want to do something like that, this is a really cool product. And if you want to do whole worlds, and there's a plugin called Worldscape, which is also really nice. I haven't used this, but I uh, heard this is a really great one. And the developers are also developer is also very active. And also there's another one called uh, Until Planet. It's not on the marketplace. It's uh, available via Gumroad. Uh, so just give it a try. And this one is not that expensive. Um, so if I want to do this, so the question is like, there are some interesting solutions in the community. And if I want to do that, I'll be a competitor with them. And um, since uh, there are so many great products and why uh, I should do something like that. And uh, as well as like, we know Unreal's uh, landscape and terrain tools are really old, but people really need a new one. They were asking every day. So after Unreal Engine 5, there is a really good chance that we will see a new landscape system for Unreal Engine. So so that's another reason I haven't uh, go through this one. While working on this open land mesh, I, I learned a lot of math. From math, I started doing a course on math as well, right on Udemy. Like if you want to grab that one, uh, just check the description. So basically it's a Unreal Engine specific course for learning math. So that's it. And also I've learned math every day and uh, it's quite interesting. And also I get into do some Houdini work and a lot of VFX. And so that's uh, my interest these days. Thank you. And I'm, I'm really sorry that I'm not continuing this uh, open land mesh product. Um, but uh, this is not the end for open land and open land grass. I have a lot of cool things uh, planned and we will see more stuff uh, coming soon and, and some new products as well. Mm, yep, yeah, uh, stay tuned and see you soon with something interesting. Bye.